Hi, my name's Sophia. Welcome to this community. So, uh, what I was getting was uh, blinded by the truth, meaning things are too close for you not to see it. And this reading, I wake up, sometimes I wake up and I know what I'm going to talk about. And this is to do with choices, the choices you made. Now, I was going to do a talk video and I thought it's interesting because of, that's also to do with choices. Because for me to do a choice, uh, a talk video, you know, I have to, um, it takes more, it's, I do a talk video, then I do tarot. It's more, it's not more draining, but more time consuming. Does it make a difference on this community? The more people book me or get into who they truly are because I do the talk video, no. But I still do it. Today I made the choice not to. I thought, well, if you don't want to hear it at the beginning of the video because you prefer a tower reading that says your person's coming towards you, right? That's your choice. This is about freedom of choice. Doesn't mean it's the correct choice. Now, I was saying about the light coming in and, you know, that means really is too close to you so you might say that your person is doing things that you just seem is stupid or you know um i don't get it why don't they just do this or why don't they just do that now it's not saying well it they're too close to you so that's why you can't see it this is connected with there's things that's too close to you which choices um you make which is incorrect for example loads of you that uh, hear this video, each one I do, particularly a collective, there is no excuse for most of you to jump in. You don't. So if you're saying that your person is like, he's in a job that he hates, and here's someone offering him a job, right, but he doesn't want to choose the other job, you're like, you don't get it, right? That's an example. And I'm like, well, I've got a community here with us as a team to help you. You don't make the leap of faith. I don't get that neither. It's the same alignment. Is it making you do it? No, because obviously when you switch off this video, you go and listen to another tower reading that tells you nothing near to get as close as what I will tell you. But still, oh no, nah, they correct me. They, You don't have the tools that can help you to make better choices. But the, at the same time, this planet is about making the choices. Nothing you do is wrong. For example, if you delay union, that's you. That's your freedom of choice. And this planet is about freedom. That's why it's not correct. It doesn't mean to me it is correct. It doesn't mean what your person is doing incorrect. They might be self-sabotaging, harming themselves, example, staying in that environment, staying with the friends, staying with following belief systems. But so are you. That's why we have the more of the emotions because we get tied uh, emotionally to someone to make the changes. But still, this is once again your choice. Does it mean because the overlying factor is about choice? And I would suggest, which I've been saying, get a pen and paper. Look at this is how you view if you're not moving forward, although most of you that are listening are not right. Uh, us in mission here on subscription are here to help you to move forward. Get a pen and paper. Now, too close to you. Like I said, I was picking up the energy of the light. What I would like you to do is write down what you think is, well, I'll just be in your face, stupid, what your person does. And not stupid like as if, let's not go overboard, like you should just get up and live with me and get married. You know, something that you really think is, you know, stupid. Like I said, his best friend is offering him, him a, a job, and which he can do. And he can get in pretty easy, but he doesn't want to do it, right? Now, I'm going to give you an example of why am I saying that. So you get a pen and paper and you write that down. Okay, I think that's stupid. It's his best friend. He can get the job. It's easy to do. He just got handed hand in his notice. And every single one of you might think of something stupid like that, not like massive thing right, that they can do. Then I want you to go deeper. I'm always telling you to go deeper. Then think about that. And how do you go deeper? I want you to put yourself in that example, right? Okay, so for example, if David had a job over there, and he said, my mate told me about a job, he does security, right? So if he says, oh, there's a security job, and I'm like, well, it's more money, why don't you just do it? This boss takes piss out of you, and he don't leave, he don't leave, he don't leave, right? I want you to pull back, this is what I would do. Suggestion, see, freedom of choice. Pull back, this is, so that's why I'm saying what I would do. Pull back and say, okay, if I was in that situation, 
why wouldn't I move? Because literally I would do that. But I am different than David. Although we are one, right? I am different, right? I've been brought up different with a different belief, traditions, etc. So I would do it. So I would pull back and say, why wouldn't he do it, right? And I'll say, okay, maybe uh, this security work I've never done. Maybe it would take a delay for him to have a full reference. Maybe he doesn't like to change jobs because he's masculine. Maybe emotions don't come to it. He likes the physicality of this job. Maybe it takes a lot of energy and drains him from swapping jobs. This is what I'm saying. The unseen is too close to you. There's things that your person does that you think, why don't you just swap? But when you go deeper and you pull back, this is about the hermit card, right? And enlightenment with the hanged man. The stagnation is because you're not going within. You don't need to see the light to move forward. Meaning you don't need your person to come to you. I love you. Let's move in and da da da. You have the inner light, right? You have the inner knowing. You have inner vision. So this is doing that. And that's what this is about now. But the bigger picture, I think, of the energy with planets, I'll see. You know, I'll check. There might be a planet in planet in planet in planet with the astrology, which is making people go into a, a mainly it's truth. But um, no, mainly it's choices, but the truths to your correct choices. And uh, like I said, it's too close to you because of to me, it's like, why don't you jump in? I know it's only the one percent. But to me, I always flip that negative to a positive like. 99% of people don't do things that they want because they're programmed. And, um, but I'm like, I'm here to focus on those 1%. Like I said, I could have done this in a talk video and talked more about your choices and how to move forward. But I thought today it's really hot in the UK. I'm just going to um, do this. If someone's like doesn't like these chat videos at the beginning, uh, uh, fuck them. They can go. They can click off and go and delude themselves that another tower reader just saying what they want to hear is going to be good for them. You know. Although 99% of you that watch this is not taking action, do exactly the same. They just do it at the end of the video. Hence, like I said, it's still delusional. It's just you just listen to the whole entire reading. Does it make you feel better because you listen to the end of the video? It doesn't make any difference, does it? I'm not really cussing you, although, yes, it does seem like it. Yes, I'm saying that's the same delusion that your person is mirroring back to you of why you don't move forward. Because you're pointing the finger. The finger's on you, right? You point the finger. Who, who holds the finger? Who's the body physicality on, right? It's very important. It's about um, understanding, inner standing, all that kind of thing. I'm going to jump into the cards. I want to say thank you to, is it Renee Lucas? Uh, she sent me an email because I said I'm engaged. Yep, yep. Uh, and she said, congratulations. So that was really nice. Now, you lot don't have to do it. I know I don't have comments and stuff like that, but that was really nice. Uh, uh, so I just wanted to say thank you. Um, yeah. Anyway, so let's jump in. Let's see. So, okay. Talking about choices, bottom of the deck, two of cups is making your choice of love. Going towards what you love. Your person is a different contract because I know that most of you, I'm a person who does love me, I feel he loves me, I feel she loves me, whatever's whatever's, why don't they come towards me? Because you're not making your better choice of loving oneself. It's not to do with me. Oh, Sophia, your cost is too much, or Sophia, the, 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 you're too, it's nothing to do with me, right? What's best for you, this community is, period. If you say it's me, it's an excuse. It's simply an excuse. If you're saying it's kids, it's an excuse, right? If you're saying it's money, it's an excuse because you could save the money, right? It's all excuses. But at the same time, it is your choice. But don't blame others because you delay it. This is about taking accountability, responsibility for your actions. I had, uh, I think, two days off, one day off. I, I, would, I didn't post yesterday. David woke up, he stayed the day before, two days, right? And he was like, and he's connected to this reading and choices. And the day he was supposed to go work yesterday, and he said, uh, he woke up, it's beautiful in the UK. He 
He said, fuck that, I'm just, uh, you know, phone in sick and take another day with you, right? So this is what you're supposed to be like me. So I was like, okay, I'm going to make the choice not to work neither because you already took the choice to take the day off to spend with me. So I told him. So I didn't. You're supposed to be free. This is this this community makes you free to make to do it spontaneous. That is freedom. I don't give a shit if you're a doctor and you're saving people's lives. In fact, doctors, you see them, they have to be chained there, which is stupid because they work so many hours and they're saving people's lives. It's like you think they would have more time to rest, but they're constantly working. How can they help people, uh, you know, with that pressure? The point is, is it is it wrong or right? It's not right. It's it's not incorrect because they have they work like 12 hours a day and they're saving people's life of operations but they do it so you are wrong you are the one who's who is who can do more my point is is about choices and whatever choices you are and your person simply shows you a reflection of what choices are you making for yourself never about your person for yourself that's what this is about okay three of cups two of wands king of cups and then i'll go into these so what's it saying here ah uh, two of cups to the three this is celebration or you know third party so is this you or your person I feel that you're here, you're actually the first card, but you're the invisible, let's just say. So the invisible to me is about tapping into manifesting, right? Because manifesting every human experience is on the physicality, which isn't actually physicality. That's just simply an experience. And what is an experience? It's unknown, right? It's not an actual tangible thing, the experience. So you're over here. So you're experiencing either three of cups negative or a celebration with the two of wands, your person coming towards you. So are they choosing the path of the third party or are they choosing to come towards you as a celebration compared to what you are manifesting from your choice? Like I said, this reading is going to be about choice at the beginning. And the choice is to choose what you want. You think your person doesn't come towards you, but look, they're already here. This is your person in the imagination. My, uh, my King of Cups, he's dreaming about you. She's dreaming about you. This card, I don't know. I just call it like they're in their imagination because they do. They do think about you a lot, right? They just literally don't talk about it, which is intentional because we're here to talk about the frequency of love. I've been watching The Matrix because apparently David said that The Matrix uh, is coming out again in, in September, November, December. I can't remember one of those dates. So I watched the, the, the one, two and three with David on Netflix. Now, uh, I, obviously it's a bit complex if you're not really into that thing. When it first came out, I didn't have a clue what he's on about. Uh, my point is that you notice that in most of these films, there's a, there's a hardcore element of love in there to show the light and the dark that kind of thing and this is what it is and i was telling him he was like yeah because of the uh on the third one um i think neo kills himself to kill the person that was ruling the earth all those agents right because they were aligned as one because the oracle i said to him i must be the oracle mate <laughs> and i like candy Right? The oracle woman was saying that you are one, right? You you are the light, he is the dark. So he's like, okay, how do I kill this person? Oh, I got to kill myself, which kills him. But I said to him, yeah, that don't mean that. Because I said to him, because me, you are aligned. This is what I said to David. I said, so what? I got to kill myself to kill you, right? I said, well, it's good because if I die, then you come upstairs with me. My point. I said, but this earthly plane is about balancing out the negative and the positive hence that long spill connected to this reading it's not about killing off the dark i said to him i said that i said i would change that ending i said because it's confusing i said this pl planet it's not that um people are there are negative people and they're normally taken over by entities from other planets that don't have the 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 um empathy 
that's why people kill or tell people to kill they don't have that empathy they have no feelings put it that way no emotions no cups right hence that's why you have to deal with that the people that rule this world don't have emotions that's why your person portrays you as non-emotional so you don't go and oh this person is so lovely that's an act right there's people i read which need to get more into their emotional state and etc etc that's why right so you don't get confused because they kill and instruct people to kill because there's entities that they've been taken out of that uh, emotions my point is here is that your person is here showing you what to do and getting into their emotional state for you to make the correct choice then choose how to manifest them towards you and it's not always as it seems because you're supposed to go within because this is like the hermit to me with wisdom you see he looks like the hermit uh, Rodolf, Rudolf, there's a Lord of the Rings or something guy he kind of looks like doesn't he this one as well so it, it's you may not think your person is coming towards you and etc etc but all you have to do is work on you I promise you like I was saying to David the confusion of the matrix to me was this earthly plane you have to learn about balance you are keep looking for your person to okay when they move out when they say they love me when I get a hint of their contacting me on a regular blah 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 right not only one you don't need to do that you just work on yourself two like for those that are following me, like Rene, I can't, I'm sorry if it's Lucas, Rene, Rene, Lucas, I just, I'm, I, 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 sorry, I didn't check, right, um, the name, I think it was Rene Lucas, so it might be a woman, anyway, right, you lot didn't know David was going to propose, and that I was going to be engaged, uh, I had an inner knowing, you have an inner knowing you're supposed to be with your person, but I didn't know it was going to be random, and just poof, but it did, and what did I do? That energy there is what you're supposed to do. You have an inner knowing, right, that there's a celebration. It's the first card with your person. The problem is, this reading with you, is that you want to see some result in a certain particular way. That's what it is. And that's another thing, wow, it's long already. That's where you need to do the work. And that's why this community is great and helps you. Because, um, I'll give an example. Right, and it's very important that you hear this example. Well, all my examples. Mr. David is going to move in. He said, hopefully sooner. He's trying to get out of the contract where he lives now, so we can live together. Right, um, but his end, his contract where he lives now ends in February next year, which is perfectly fine. I didn't know he was going to. Well, I did. We had the conversation, but anyway, right. I had a knowing, right, inner knowing that he was going to we was going to have that anyway, right, that was going to happen, but some people may say, well, it would be nice if David made the choice to just live with me, instead of, well, you know, the end of the contract, so I may as well live with Sophia, do you see what I mean, so is he making the choice to live with me, or his contract's ending, and he doesn't like where he lives, do you see my point, now, here's another thing, that's what, this is why this fucks up your union, because you pull it that way. This is how I see it. I know my person's supposed to live with me. If the universe puts a situation that is unknown to me to make David want to live with me, for me to maybe mention it and, or him mention it, and he says, yes, that's when we'll live together, that's the result, right? Cause and effect. He's going to live with me anyway. Does it matter how it gets there? That's what you lot fuck up. Well, no, I prefer him to you know, come and show up this way, I prefer her to do it that way, that's your preference, but you said to the universe, as me, which, did I say that, maybe, I that maybe, yeah, maybe I did, because I'm always saying that I don't know if I'm sure about David living with me, but underneath, yes, obviously, if it was like, yes, it would be, yes, I would prefer David living with me, so I asked the universe to David to live with me, so they've manifested a nightmare situation with his neighbours and that, so that he wants to move, happy days, so he's then choosing, well, okay, yeah, let's live together, do you see, it's all about your choice, so the end result, but I had to trust that that was going to happen, you lot would either not even work on yourself in the first place, right, because you're waiting for then David to say, okay, I'll move in, all right, I'm going to do a community, I'm going to do tarot, I'm gonna, there's a sign, 
But manifestation doesn't work like that. That's why I'm saying you're over here as the invisible. Me, myself and I, or you and higher self and other people, other people here, three of cups, right, is upstairs. Depends how long you've been following me. How I create this community is most of my family is dead, right? So I, I've had a good relationship with my brother, Henry, um, my mum, me, uh, my dad, me, uh, uh, my aunties and that, all of them, like, most of them upstairs. My sister's twin flame as well, right? All passed over. So when I was here by myself, I didn't really talk to people. I talked to them. And I, I weren't just uh, talking to them. You know, when you say you just got a random thing, you know, what's going on in my life? What the fuck? Or something like that, right? So I asked, uh, and that's how I start with them lot. I never said, or it Henry, because of my brother's name who's passed away, hence he's on my subscription list, <laughs> Henry, or, or to my mum, I go, or oh, you lot, because there's a load of them, right? What happens was I used to pull in anyone, because I said, you lot. Why am I spitting out that? Because you're looking at third party and the physicality of other people, right? To for including your person to say they come away from this Jane or come away from Sarah or come away from the mum, just say something like that. And actually he's just he's just grabbing his wand and, and going towards the earthly plane. Also an expectation of them to change into that spirituality and all that kind of thing. Like me, like I'm engaged. Should I wait for David to come into the community and me and him do a video? Hey, we're engaged video, right? I don't know when that's going to happen. I don't even know if he's supposed to be back in the community. I don't know. So I said to him, shall I Shall I say it, right? I said, when you tell other people about um, us engaged, then I'll mention it on the community. Cool. So he's done it, so, I'm gonna, so that's when I've done it. Does it matter if I had a big video with me and him next to each other? This is what this reading is about. What are you bothered about or do you just want to be engaged? That's this kind of thing. Or do you just want your person? Do you see? Because I would say, do you want to be engaged with a person? Yeah, that would be great. Well, what if you didn't have to go and do an exposure and that it was just like, you know, here's a ring or something like that? Do you see what I mean? You'll be like, oh, I prefer him to come on bended knee. Do you see my point? This is what this is about. Love is love. This is understanding about the 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 third party which is the invisibility of what you don't know right because you don't really see it all this third party thing you don't even know what's going on there and that's the illusion but all your person is focused on as they it's it's interesting because this is all about you and you think it's your person but to me the king of cups is your person over there right he's a king at this he does his thing over there, she does her thing over there, as soon as they stop, they're in their imagination state thinking about their love, wishes and desires. Generally, kids you, kids you, and that's what you're supposed to do. This reading at the beginning is like, well, no, um, that, because that's their contract to do it that way. This is about how you perception, choices, um, um, stuff like that. This is about, I said this in the other reading, stillness, the art of stillness, right? Putting down your sword in the battle, as my sister was saying in her readings, and um, after heartbreak, some of you are going through this heartbreak thing, and just recognising what you're doing about this third party situation. Not what your person's doing, what you're doing, what your perception is, Right? And then all of a sudden they give you an answer how to move forward. And you just say things like when David was in his community, I still don't know when he was in his community, how he got into it. And then uh, I, uh, then he stopped. He got his another job. It's like I stopped seeing him for a bit when he moved into this place. I didn't really, I knew where he was previous was unhealthy. So when he moved to the other place, I was just glad he was moving to somewhere else because where he saw it, it was his friend. But to me, it was unhealthy, right, where he was staying with his friend. I've told him anyway. So he's moved and it's amazing, that independence. But it's far. It's, it's really hard for me to get there, really hard for me, him to get here. What can I do? Oh, you want to move again? No. So I just left it and just I didn't even trust nothing. I just carried on, put it that way. 
then what happened like i said oh well that maybe was meant to be so that he can say okay i've had my little space for my my man cave time by my independence now i can move in plus he's then so his mate offered him a new job so he's got less out uh four on four off so i can see him more i didn't tell him nothing i didn't ask him nothing I tried my best. I said, well, okay, we just work round when we work round. If you, I get an hour with you, I'm happy with the hour, right? Because I knew he was knackered. He used to stay up. I said, just sleep. We just, I'll just watch a film and you just nod off, right? Just because I've done it, right? That's what you have to do. This is where most people fuck up in the union. They always try a pinpoint, which well, should be going this way. Why should it? You put out to the universe what you want and then what comes in, what comes in. It's like actors. I want to be a famous actor. When they give you well, you say, hi, my name's Sarah. And that's a famous actor. You're on telly. Millions of people hear you say, hi, my name's Sophia. Oh, well, I want a longer role. Did it? Well, that takes time. You've got to work at it. Right? Once again, the delay is corruption on planet Earth. And two, to show there's no such thing as time. I said to David, how long do you think we've been together? Two or three years. And we both weren't sure. I went, I had to go into this YouTube channel and check on the, what's it called? I don't know, community, there's something about, about page. And it's got August 2018, I started. And I said to him, do the dots, because I'm crap at the maths. I said, I met you before I opened this channel, November. So we've known each other three and a half years. Didn't even know. And he said, why are you bothered about time? I said, I'm not. I said, but two years or three years is a year, big, quite a big difference. He said, yeah, I see what you mean. Three and a half, we thought it's two. That means time speeds up, right, when you're with someone who's great. When you're with someone who's boring, a meeting at work, it slows down, right? That, that proves that theory alone. This proves there's no time because I'm predicting your past, future or uh, the now. This reading is all your potential, but it's your choice of the potential. Then your person comes living with you, right? It's all what I say, then they come living with you anyway. Most of you say, right, I want my, my person to get married, have the house, the car and everything. That is the contract from 5D. Yeah, you can have what you want with your person, but... We wipe your brain so you don't have an expectation of having it that way, but you get that eventually anyway. And you, right, have a knowing of this when you meet your person. So you must go on that knowing because you must teach people how to go of their knowing, not of beliefs, traditions, words, emotional words spoken, etc., etc. That's what this is about. Then you'll be victorious because your person is already there doing it, right? Simply not expressing it, simply not saying it, but they're already doing what they're supposed to do, right? Are you? Your person is already victorious, putting the five, the, the, the people behind you and moving forward. This was the time of the Aquarius age for the masculines to wake up, which they are doing. What are you doing? The underneath is, is this always you? And this is about Nick, this blatantly of Alistair Crowley, gangster cards. These are, um, how do I say that word? I've forgotten, it's just gone blank. Crystallized form, <laughs> there it is. Can you see, they're kind of invisible. I said to her, make them invisible. Crystallized form, which is connected with the avatar body, right? And you think about that avatar body, the film avatar, they, they not know about us, man. It's you who don't know. Hollywood knows about us. Go and watch Infinite. Go and watch Sense8. Right? That's proper twin flame films. This is about your foundation needs to crumble. About how it doesn't matter if millions of people are shouting Sophia's a fucking idiot. Right? I know the truth. And you know what I speak of truth. Stop following the fucking sheep. Right? Stop following the sheep. Loads come in the community, loads leave and go and follow the people that chat shit and don't offer nothing. 
Why is my person not coming towards me victoriously? They are changing. You're just not taking the motions here because you're following other people's foundation of what to do. Absolutely. You're following other people's. And like I said, it's like seeing things. Stop expecting your person to be. So just accept who they are and do your stuff. Do your stuff, right? That's what this is about. So let's uh, get a couple of others. And then this will, but it's your foundation, is it? Because look, this is your person, Victorious. It's always you. If you haven't got your person come towards you, it's always you. I don't know why I'm the one who can read and tell you what it is and pinpoint. Uh, she tells pretty good. Well, all of them are really good. I'll take that back. It's not just she tell. Everyone in this community is really good, but I can really go deep. And that is intentional because you want to access me to know what to do. You have to commit to mission. I'm not wasting my time doing image readings on people who just want to know what to do just for the sake of it because it sounds good. So it's intentional because you're not here because I can't guarantee you your person unless you're in mission. And mission is to change planet Earth. At this vibration of what you're at, you're still selfish. You're still wanting things from your person. So that means that one right if you're at the point just happy with your person coming around and just chilling not affecting what they say not affecting what other people say you are human for example i've disabled the comments right um because i'm human and if 10 of you said congratulations but one said oh you're a fucking idiot you're fake or whatever that would affect me i'm human right so you make choices to i'm um, like well i don't need the comments or the likes or subscribe i know them lot um who's happy for me is happy for me anyway like i said if you've been here long you see go i don't know if i deleted it i don't think so go watch my birthday video all the people who fakely said happy birthday sent me a cake balloons i've never had that before in my life where are those lot now they all left right they were oh sophia so amazing i really appreciate you've changed my life this is this reading right it's all bullshit. You're not committed. You're not really committed to why you're here. It's an impossibility for you to be with your person unless you're fully, fully committed. And even the twin flames that are up here, aren't they committed in mission? Just because their mission is different to the contract that I'm saying here. If, the con if you're aligned with me, this is your mission, right? Which it, I feel is a better mission because I make you more independent, connecting with a collective which helps you. You know, obviously, more in teams helps you go out there far more. Oh, sis. Oh, my God. Don't, don't, don't. I think this is my worst card, right? 3D. Still watching TV and listening to commercial music. Go and watch. Is it in my list? I don't know where. It's a video and it's got Beyonce on it. Go watch that one in my uh, playlist, right? You still listening to commercial music? your person does this all day long right don't watch that i watched the infinite with david yesterday and there's this mark Wahlberg, and i said that's you the main character when i finished the film i was like no i'll take that back you're worse than this guy because <laughs> he was he was totally disagreeing with the film i was like oh lord jesus this is, david is broken this is worse right they are 3d they're totally 3d don't watch that it's for you to come out of it. Not your person. Not your person. You are not selling enough in your tower bookings. That's to admission, people. You're watching this video. You're not selling enough, right? And why is that important for those that are listening, right? Because these cards are for people who get into mission. Because you're not helping anyone if you're just being greedy and just selling a tower reading. It does nothing. I've already said to you lot, you want to make changes in your life. I only give image reading for those who want to make changes. Otherwise, it's pointless to you. And therefore, I know it's pointless to you. Therefore, I will get karma. To do anything upon another. It doesn't say to murder. Well, I think it is. right? To murder, you only get um, bad things. No. Don't do to others that you do, don't want done to yourself. I would not want to go to another tower reader to promise me something or book a tower reading, which they don't actually. I don't think they actually pro promise anything. But to sell stuff that they know that doesn't do anything. Hence I said this is about 
clarity, enlightenment going within. So I know that me just giving you an image reading without you committing with mission and fully in the programs, it's pointless. I know that. That's why I don't. And I, in fact, I, I tell you to go with anything. So those that are in mission, if they're just doing a tower reading, you're just booking them for a tower read, and I tell them to sell. Sell the tarot, sell the program, sell everything. Sell them to get you to make the changes, right? To get you to make the changes. And you might think, well, that's taking money. Well, it's not. Because if I'm helping you to be independent and free and an entrepreneur and to get you in, in your mission to change humanity, to change planet Earth, to die with known of being something, this community stands for something, to make fucking changes on this planet, right? Activists, humanitarian, to be part of this or you're going to stay over there. A doctor ain't going to be known as something. This community is known for something. When I die, it, our people will know and I've tried to change this planet. What are you doing? So yeah, sell, I tell them, sell. So you're helping to change not just that one person, which most people die, they don't change anyone's life. Okay, let's grab, I'll do that last. A message of good news, someone creative. There's a page though. Pages are the messages, so it might be you might not see it as good news with this reading. So your person might be coming back or something. It doesn't always mean your person. And that's another thing. That, oh, gosh, this reading is long. You know, when people say, oh, message, you should pay, your person come back with a message, a passionate offer. It's like, well, yeah, it doesn't say that um, you might not do the offer. If you're working on yourself and I'm connecting with you in mission, I might say to you right now, because I have a communication tools, like which outlines when to contact your person. Or people email me, like Andrea emailed me, I'll get to that Andrea, your email about your person, and then I reply on what they tell me. They're guided, oh my person's contact me, shall I reply? And I'll say no, hold back, or when to go forward. This is about you might have to take go and say something, then they come back in. And maybe it doesn't even start with an apology. Once again, this is about words. Your person teaches you it's not just about words, it's about the frequency of what you live. You live, you know they love you. Hence I said with the Matrix, Neon and what's her name, the other woman, how deep their love is, right? It's a love movie, but corruption of planet Earth, dark and light, love, hate. That's what it is. As within, so without. If you're not help, if you're not aligned within, your person is mirroring to you as without. It's one hundred percent. And like I said, are you expecting your person to come with an apology? This might be the time. This card is showing you. So other tower readers who don't do readings like mine might take the action. This card to me is like I bet you when you go and text them or something, they might reply. This card, Eight of Cups. This is walking away and walking towards proper work right the hermit goes and the eight of cups is um is a hard thing to do but a, a choice is being made to do it this is what you lot don't do that's why people leave oh yes i am committed i even talked to them people who was here yeah i don't understand why they do this i don't understand why they do that and then they go and do it they go do the easier option changing planet earth is not easy so many people die and they're known for nothing how many funerals, they have never been funerals, but you go to it and like, oh, he was known as this, he was so good, and people are crying, and then they forget the people, right? I don't. This whole world is fucked. When they're upstairs, it's party land. Not meaning they're partying, I mean it's fucking amazing. I tell you, if I didn't have kids or my sister, I probably would kill myself, even though I hate pain, so I don't know how that would work. Because they know I want to go upstairs, they keep me grounded. I'm not galactic in the slightest. You might think I am because I connect with consciousness and spaceships and stuff like that. Um, they keep me on this planet because they know as soon as I go upstairs, I'm like, beam me up, Scotty. This is understanding that you have to 
go into those energies that I talk about, then you can connect with upstairs as above, so below, right? Because your person is the king, at, king of it, the king of caps. This is the eight, right? Walking towards nine, emotional fulfilling, right? When you're emotionally fulfilled, this work is rewarding to me, emotionally fulfilling, then your person comes. Like I said, I don't care if you're a doctor. You're Sophia, I'm a doctor. I change planet Earth. You don't have a, you know, something about doctors are so amazing. Oh, what was it with this virus? There was all this, um, I don't know if it's everywhere. It's, uh, appreciate NHS. You know, the hospitals helping with all these people that are dying in hospital. I don't even want to go down that line. Yeah, right. Anyway, my point is that's not changing anyone's life, right? My health program, I promise you, can change your life more than that, a doctor. Prevention is better than the, the cause of it, right? My health program will be the prevention of what, what these diseases that the doctor that you may be that then removes that disease. That dis-ease, you need the ease. My program will talk about ease, the health program. Everything I create is for a reason. Not just because, oh, well, I, I've got loads of programs. Oh, I'll do health. Not this community. Same people pleasing in this reading. And you might, I'm not pleasing anyone. Well, yes, you are. Go to my playlist. Or go to the video, Masculine, Feminine. Afterwards, there's a test. Got to change up my playlist. Don't know when I'm going to do that. If you were that committed, you are just invest in that. The playlist is re irrelevant. The playlist is literally a longer version of cha making changes right it, the the twin flame program star seed program master program sex program or condensed of the smallest amount you have to do to make mission and make you get with your person the playlist is a longer strung out version i condensed it right with the most relevant points in the in the programs which you can buy of me or anyone the heart i said this is about the heart of the matter pulled in i said people pleasing see all these this is all the negative energies around you of roots because it's tree right roots it's a bit blurred there right it's roots you got see see her conviction right positive or pushing forward not just casually like people coming in and out of mission casually yeah i'm committed sophia uh really where are you following other tarot readers who are just doing a reading with nothing to offer you. That's why your person, you think, has nothing to offer you, right? I ain't offering you jack shit. You're going to tarot readers that offer you jack shit. Do you see this mirror? Do you understand what you're doing? That's what this is. Conviction to come out of that old belief system of just following people that don't help you and serve you. I said that in my last reading. It's not about blood Choice overrides blood. Choice overrides blood. Let's finish with a he or she. Now let's do one of these. I went to here. Oh, just done that. Why do they want me to pick another one? That's probably why. It's your choice to be happy. Your choice to follow your success. It's your choice for celebration. So they're highlighting this card twice. This is the negative side, third party. This is the positive, your happiness. It's your choice. Which one are you going to take? Let's see what he, she is thinking or feeling. And I think they're thinking about you. Uh, I would say they're thinking about their happiness because they're looking at the emotion, the ace of cups here, your person. So that depends if... It's not that if you, they, you make them happy. That's not the equation now. It's about... Well, actually, yeah, if you're, if you're moody and you're shitty and you're blocking them and cussing them, that's not going to be into the happiness. But at the moment, this has got the, see the dolphins? So you might be getting telepathic communication. Now, that's them in their imagination. That's the telepath, that's telepathic communication, imagination. So that card might come out. Still hidden then. Still hidden, I feel, with your person about what they're saying, because this reminds me a bit of the moon card as well. So even if your person comes back and the tower reader, now they're coming up and they're going to apologise, you're going to, first, oh, they're going to apologise, then say they love me. Oh, they're going to apologise, then say they, they're going to move in with me. This reading is saying, stop, 
thinking about that. Write down what you really want, right? Or buy the programs, buy some counseling, get tower reading, get into mission, and we can help you and guide you like where we are. At the end of the day, they do choose you. I said this entire reading is about what? Choice. Their choice. They made the choice to choose you from 5D, right? Such as you, right, chose them. That is not the issue. The issue is the 3D perception that stops you two from being together on your side. He is already in the imagination here, right? Which is what you're supposed to do, right? Oh, he's delusional. Yes, correct. It's not delusional what you're doing in the aspect of what you're um, not making moves forward. It doesn't make, it doesn't make any sense. <laughs> it's no sense there. It's nonsensical. My, I said this entire reading is about choices. I choose who? You. He's telling you. She's telling you. Choose you. Not what the best tower reader says that makes you feel better for that second. Choose what's best for you. This community is here and does. No one on this platform does anything better than this small community so far. No one, right? So choose you. I'm out. Speak to you later.